Hi, I'm Jack, a computer science student at Cardiff University. In this video, I'll be introducing you to our OSINT detective style online platform named Cyber Detective. So before we get started, what actually is OSINT? Open source intelligence is all about collecting information about someone or something. Think a person, a company, an animal, anything which has unique attributes. The important thing to remember here is that this is not hacking but rather uses information you can find from the public, free and legal resources available online. At no time would you gain unauthorised access to anything, so please do remember this as you're going about the exercises. Whilst you're working through the challenges on the platform, have a think about each one and how it might apply to you and your family. Is there a privacy setting that you could change in any of your social media profiles? Any posts you could potentially delete in order to tighten your personal security online? So here I am at the Cyber Detective CTF website. You should be able to see the link on your screen now. In order to create an account, select the register button at the top right hand side of the page. When selecting your username, it is very important that you type TC dot before you input your desired name, as this will enable the Technocamps team to track your score and ensure that you are awarded the right number of points for yourself and your school. For the email, please do not use any real address you may have. Simply make one up like I do here. Please remember your username and password, however, or jot them down somewhere just so you don't get locked out of your account and lose any points that you may have accrued. Once you're happy with your entries, click the submit button and your account will be created. If you're asked to do so, it could be a good idea just to save your password and just to prevent yourself from getting locked out. And that's this step of the introduction all done, so let's carry on. Submitting an answer to a challenge is a simple two-stage process. Clicking on any challenge card will open a window presenting the challenge itself and a box for you to enter your answer. When you've got an answer you're happy with, click the submit button and you will be notified as to whether or not you got it right, or if you need to have another look. Correctly answering a challenge will highlight it in green on the main challenge page. You may now continue answering other challenges within the CTF. Well done. This is a really important stage of the process as this will enable Technocamps to know that you have started attempting the challenges. They will be working behind the scenes in order to ensure that you are credited the points on the Technocamp website and this will give you the chance of winning the prize. Please ensure that you are happy to provide your consent for this to happen and fill in the form truthfully. The last section here is where you'll be telling Technocamps the username uh, beginning with TC dot that you made earlier. If you haven't got a username that follows this format, please return to the relevant section of the video in order to create one. This concludes the introduction to the Cyber Detective activity. Do keep an eye out for future videos to be released by Technocamps, which will explore more challenges across all streams on the platform. I hope that you have found this helpful, and I wish you all the best as you go on to complete the challenges.